are gearing up for St. Patrick's Day with St. Patrick's Day music, as well as some Irish food. And joining me now to talk about a, some Irish traditional dishes is Ken Mark. He is the co-founder here at the Hannibal History Museum to talk about soda bread and corned beef and cabbage. But this is cottage pie. What is in cottage pie that Irish people used to eat all the time? Well, cottage pie is a variation of what's called shepherd's pie. Uh, back then, and even today, I guess, if you don't have a lot of money, you take whatever uh, you happen to have maybe left over from your stock. And uh, in this case, uh, if it's shepherd's pie, it would be lamb. And it wouldn't just be meat, it would be also some of the sweet meats, as we call it. <coughs> sweet meats, that's and, a nice uh, way to say it. <laughs> yeah, and this is actually ground beef, so that's why we call it cottage pie. It's just a variation on it. Uh, now. St. Patrick's Day is uh, March 17th because that was the day of the passing of St. Patrick. And while we use a lot of corned beef and cabbage to celebrate that uh, in America, it over in Ireland you wouldn't really have seen that. You would have seen more like boiled ham, boiled potatoes. Um, and, and that doesn't sound exactly, you know, mouth-watering, but uh, <laughs> it worked for them. Why boiled potatoes? Why as a sweet meat? Well, boiling is a, a, an easier method, a uh, more consistent method of cooking. You know it's cooked. You, it's hard to overboil a potato, whereas if you have an open fire hearth, you just never know on a time. And also they do a combination. You may boil something and then mash it up and then cook it over a fire later for a different consistency. Well, coming up on Cage Crew this morning, we're going to be uh, talking with the Irish Ragtag Band that's providing that ambiance music behind us. And you can find the website on our website at cagecrew.com. You can find the recipe for this cottage pie. We're going to have lots more Irish shindig talk coming up on Cage Career this morning.